The tagline of my jigging book is presentation is king. And the reason I focus so heavily on that is because jigging is really a highly nuanced technique. There's a lot involved to it. It's a lot more than just bouncing a jig head up and down. So I start with the basics of lure types and selection and go into really the thing that stops a lot of people from being successful is, you know, those most common errors. I see it almost every time somebody's learning. So I spend a lot of time going into that as well as how changing your rod sweep impacts how your lure behaves. In fact, I spent a lot of time illustrating how different depths of water create much different presentation. And there's a lot of discussion about popular soft plastics and what situations you'd want to add a skirt, as well as what that does to your presentation. And then I really go into the finer details of vertical jigging, working and finding that sweet spot in a drift, casting and retrieving in a multitude of conditions. Of course, the always popular how to fish a piling, uh, dealing with wind, which is, which is a pain for all of us. And then several methods for successfully catching this tricky suspended fish. And of course, one of my secret tricks I developed, which at this point really is no longer a secret, a technique I call jig trolling. There's a whole lot in this how-to guide, 400 pages packed with the best tips and tricks. And I've done my best to teach you these finer techniques through how I learn best, which is through diagrams, illustrations, and photos, rather than just words. You're bound to run into these situations on the water, and when you do, you'll be prepared. When the fish are schooled up, thick and feeding, yeah, anyone can catch them. Unfortunately, it's just not how it works most of the times out there. So, sharpen your skills and join the thousands of anglers that have done so through my books. They're available on Facebook, Amazon, and local tackle shops.